Now the good news, housing numbers finally improving. CNBC's Melissa Lee has the details on that. Melissa, good morning to you. Good morning to you, Matt. This is certainly good news for sellers of homes like this one. Uh, for the first time in seven months, new data showing that sales of existing homes actually went up. It is being called a surprise rise. On Monday, America's realtors reported that last month, sales of existing homes increased by 2.9 percent nationally. The first gain since last July is a rare glimmer of hope for America's hurting housing market. I think we're starting to turn a corner. Home prices have fallen 8.2 percent from a year ago, and realtors like Matt Garrison in Chicago say prices are now too low for buyers to ignore. People are starting to feel like this is pretty close to the bottom. Uh, which is obviously the best time that they could they could jump in and buy. Home sales were still down in the West, but the Midwest and South saw gains of just over 2 percent. The Northeast led the growth in sales with an increase of 11.3 percent. The housing market seems to be giving the first indications of stabilizing, at least in terms of home purchases. While economists caution nationally existing home sales are still down almost 24 percent compared to last year, some say the free fall may be over. Every bit of good news is good news for the economy now. We're, we're looking for things to stabilize. We don't want the economy to fall into a deep recession. Many believe that a recession is inevitable, but they are hoping that this good news out of the housing sector will mean that any slowdown will be less shallow and shorter than previously expected. And CNBC's Melissa Lee, thanks so much.